we're live now. Um, been live for a couple minutes. Figured I'd just go ahead and get this going here. Give me one second, guys. Um, so, anyways, welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome. You've got me here, uh, the wonderful Longwood Geek. Uh, and I've got beside me, to my right, Puck. Hello. Yep. Uh, Puck doesn't want to be on camera right now, which is fine. Um, they just, they're in their, you know, comfy onesie and I'm in my, my mom says I'm special. Sure. <laughs> partly because I'm playing Fallout 4 and partly because I hung out with my mother earlier today and I'm pretty sure she absolutely agreed with this. If you knew my mother, you would totally get that. Oh, whoops. I guess I probably should get rid of Mark that. So, um, earlier this week... Um, which was really cool. We, um, we had a, we have a friend of ours who hasn't been doing so hot medically. Um, I mean, unfortunately it, it's just, you know, life, is, life sucks. Um, and so unfortunately they just have not been doing that hot. And because of that, um, I reached out to a couple of awesome people I know over at Bethesda Gameworks, um, and asked if there was anything they could do. Um, they are, you know, uh, one of the, the person in particular who is suffering from the rather nasty ailment, uh, cancer is, uh, honestly, I don't normally use this language this early in the day, but cancer is a bitch folks and needs to go, you know, suck on something foul tasting. Um, as someone who suffered with, you know, many medical conditions myself, um, I know I've been lucky because, well, I'm still here and able to talk to you about it. The main thing, like with me, I had I've had tumors out. I've had uh, I've developed an autoimmune disorder. I've had various organs removed. I'm on immunosuppressants, you know. But none of those have been as terrifying or as unfightable as cancer can be. Uh, cancer is a bitch. I have no better way to put it. I really don't. Without using even more foul language. Um, so, like I said, we reached out uh, to a couple of friends of mine that work at Bethesda Softworks and asked them if there was anything they could send our friend. Um, they had no idea it was coming. We had, in fact, we had zero um, warning for them. Um, we kept a surprise. We didn't know for sure um, when something was gonna be sent or what it was gonna be. Um, so we didn't wanna, we didn't wanna, you know, chance on, on mixing up a time schedule or something like that. So we just, we waited and we waited and, and I say we waited like it was a long time. I think it was literally like, what, two weeks from the uh, time I put it into um, the time at which they sent something, I think. Because it was right after, right around Mysticon, uh, which was the end of February. Yeah. I think I put it in what, like right before that maybe? I think so. I mean, it was one of those things that it just, it was very, very quick. Um, for, I mean, honestly, you know, for a game company, um, and for even though, you know, it's my friends that work there, um, you know, it was just, yeah, um, I, I can't tell you how, how amazing it was for them to, um, to have, have gotten and acted on it this quickly. I mean, honestly, these, my two friends there, and I'm not going to name names, um, in case they don't want to be mentioned. Um, I didn't, I didn't tell anybody we were doing a thank you ahead of time, kind of like the other surprise. I really just kind of wanted to, um, let it just be, you know, as, as, as pure a surprise as it could be. Um, so with that in mind, give me one second guys. Um, cause I'm, I'm actually like multitasking at this particular moment. Uh, cause I kind of wanted to do this with, with. Um, let's see if I turn, okay, guys, so if I turn that off so I can, <laughs> yeah, I really should remember to like, like do the plan this stuff ahead of time. And one of these days, I'm, I'm sure I probably will. Um, today, however, not is not that day. day. It's not that day. It is not that day at all. So let me pop over to that folder real quick. Um, all right. So yeah, I need to shrink, shrinky dink that just a little bit. Put it in the oven. Oh, what is that Shrinky Dinks thing? Yes. Thank you, Shrinky Dinks. Oh, transform. Uh, 
Set your discreet. Okay, fit discreet. I, I really, really should like do this ahead of time. There. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, so we're gonna slide this over here. And so we are going to turn that one off. Okay, so as I was saying, our wonderful, wonderful friends at Bethesda um, totally just, they, they went above and beyond. Um, and so we get a uh, message one day. Um, well, I say we get a message. Um, Puck was watching our friends' Facebook, um, just, you know, seeing what was up. And we... Um, so Puck messages me while I'm at work and says, hey, you might want to check somebody's Facebook. Um, I believe they got your surprise or our surprise. And I went, oh, really? And so this is what, um, what we saw <laughs> at that particular moment on um, Facebook. It's, you know, what the hell just happened? Does someone have something they'd like to tell me? I literally have no idea what's going on. A poster package just got delivered, and my dad and I opened it up and saw that it's a Skyrim poster covered in names. I immediately grabbed the tube, looked at the sender, Bethesda Softworks Studio. I'm hyperventilating. It's covered in the autographs of the actual Skyrim dev team. I have no idea why this happened, who prompted this, no clue whatsoever what's going on. The day was going horribly. My arm in extreme and inexplicable agony. Methocarbonol from yesterday gave me a massive stomach ache. I even puked like 30 minutes ago. But holy crap, day rescued. And so um, what was so awesome is, the, is what they sent. Like I said, I had no clue what they were sending. Um, I just said, can you send anything? And my friends went, we got you, fam. And so um, the, we, they ended up sending this which is a signed poster, signed Skyrim poster by all the dev team. And I mean, that is just, I cannot, uh, that was not, I wasn't expecting, I knew they were sending something awesome, but like that, other way, there we go, like, yeah, there, we, there we go, like that. I'm still learning camera angles in relation to what I've got on the screen. Um, so I really was not, not, a, a, other one, other one. I really was not expecting, I feel like my mother's, Broken finger here. Come on. Up, up. Nope. They're almost pretty. Ooh, there, we go. Eep, there we go. Okay, so that was what they sent, my friend. Um, and so, our friend, I say. Because um, really, I know him through Puck. But that's what they sent. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm in shock. I'm in awe. Um, they went, like I said, Bethesda went above and beyond for them. On this, I mean, I was like, I, we didn't, we didn't know what they were to send. Um, I didn't know when they were to send it. I didn't know how they were to send it, but they got it. And honestly, I can't. Bethesda, we, we cannot thank you enough. I know they cannot thank you enough. To my two friends, uh, M and A at Bethesda, you guys are amazing. Thank you so much for doing this. It meant a lot to them. It still means a lot. They're still here. I promise. Um, but, I mean, that, I mean, you just, you can't get better than that. You really can't. Um, so, again, Bethesda, you guys are wonderful, and thank you so much. Because um, it means it means a lot to her. As you can see from the message, it really, when you're feeling that just shitty from meds and chemo and arm stuff and body stuff and all that, I mean, that, that's incredible and we just we can't thank you enough Bethesda so I just want to start my stream off kind of with that because um yeah that that was just I was in awe I mean that that was I had no idea what they were sending but they they outdid themselves so thank you they really just Bethesda from the bottom of our hearts uh m a from the bottom of our hearts you know from Puck and I and our friend P thank you so much you know we 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 heart you um so, yeah. Puck, you got anything you want to add to that? Thank you, Bethesda. That works. Let me go ahead and kill this, this window here. Um, speaking of Bethesda, we're going to be going ahead and uh, we're going to be playing some more Fallout uh, 76 today. Um, I'm finally hit level 25, so I'm able to use power armor. Uh, not just the frame, but I can actually craft power armor pieces, uh, which I'm really looking forward to. And we're going to just, we're going to, we're going to just have some fun. I mean, you know, even if I wasn't already playing, um, Fallout 76 today, 
Um, I probably would have played a Bethesda game of some kind just as thank you. Um, again, you just, it's, um, yeah, I just, I can't say thanks enough. So, oops, give me one second here, let me figure out, before we get started with the game, I just need to figure out why it is. Oh, okay, I see. So weird. Anyways, hopefully it should go back to normal after that. Cool. Sorry, just looking at my internet bill. So, yeah, love getting bills in while I'm talking. But anyways, like I said, you know, if I wasn't already playing a Bethesda game today, today would have been a Bethesda game day just to, just to think Bethesda. Um, no, I am not, you know, drinking the Kool-Aid. In fact, I'm drinking a Diet Pepsi. Um, but... You know, I really, when a company goes above and beyond to do something like that, yeah, I, I have no problems. Yep. <laughs> Not mad, just thirsty. I thought, it was like, I thought you were just recovering the... I was. Okay. That's what I said. Not an ad, just thirsty. <laughs> What? Hashtag not sponsored. Yes, hashtag. hashtag not sponsored. Hashtag if you want to sponsor me. Well, I ain't going to say no. I tail. I tail. I tail. Good tail. Uh, so anyways, guys, let's go ahead and get some get started with some Fallout 76.